Season's greetings, little beans. Morning. The following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in the need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite anime character. There won't be any NSFW versions on this ASMR. This is for all ages and it's appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, then click off. To the ones who are staying, go right ahead and get all cozy in your blankies, plop in your headphones, snack on some Scooby snacks, and enjoy this ASMR. That was a fun Halloween party we went to! Yeah, I never realized we got to win, and we got a bunch of candy! Look, I understand we have a lot of candy, but maybe we can give it to the trick-or-treaters. What? How- Why can't we just have them? Come on! Uh, Kilua, it's still Halloween. Plus, it'll be a waste of candy. Mm, fine. I really want to get, take this costume off. I'm tired of being Velma. But you look cute as Velma. Wait, is that supposed to be a skirt or shorts? It's shorts. I do not want to wear a skirt. <laughs> what are you laughing at, Leorio? <laughs> Nothing. I just can't believe you dressed as Velma. I wanted to be frickin' Fred, but no, I had to be Velma. I mean, listener, I think you would have been a great Velma, not gonna lie. <laughs> what, you wear glasses too? Hmm, okay, I mean, you're still a cute Daphne. Oh, anyway, let's just head on home and then we can repaint this car and, yeah, enjoy some candy. Aw, I, I, we worked really hard on this car! Well, Gone, it's only for that one time of year, so of course we have to repaint it back. Aww! I worked really hard on the writing. Well, let's head on home, guys. Or, let's head on, gang. Could up go. Just because you're... Never mind. Are we home yet? Only in a few minutes, gone. Huh. Did you forget to turn on your GPS? I, I did, but I think it's leading me somewhere different. Different? Uh, Kurapika, I think you may have messed up the location. I can't focus. I need to watch the road. Uh, I don't like the look of this place. I don't know why we're in a dark forest. Mm. Well, if we're going to be lost, I mean... Maybe we can just find a hotel and stay there just for one night. Hey, I think that'd be a good idea. At least I can take off this stupid costume. Hey, look. Huh? Uh, Kurapika, are you sure this is a hotel? I mean, it must say it is. Huh, it looks like this building hasn't been touched in forever. How would you know, Kilua? I don't know, just looking at it. It's like a haunted house. Haunted house? Okay, come to think of it, it kind of does. Well, let's go check it out and see if anyone is in there. Okay. What's the matter, Shaggy? Are you scared? <laughs> I'm not scared. <laughs> what are you talking about? <coughs> that was just a crowly Oreo. I knew that. <laughs> My... Kilua is not joking. This place looks like it hasn't been running for a century. Needs a touch-up. I don't think this really is a hotel, Kurapika. Hello? Is anyone in here? Hello? Hmm. I don't think anyone could hear us. I think we should go, guys, if there's not going to be anybody. Yeah, I'm getting a bad vibe off of this place. Oh, greetings, gentlemen. Run, go! Uh, are your friends okay? Oh, they're fine. They're just in character because, you know, it's Halloween. <laughs> I see. You guys look really great. I think you're the Scooby-Doo gang, right? Well, yes. <laughs> it's kind of funny that you guys appeared in this haunted hotel. Wait, this, this is actually a haunted hotel? Well, yes. That just made it even worse. Quiet, Shaggy. Yeah, this hotel has been haunted f ever since the 60s. Legend has it that the ghost has been haunting the haunted hallways in the second floor. 
Hmm, maybe we can get a room on the first floor? Sally, they're all booked. Oh, what about the third floor? They're also booked too, so I have no other choice but to give you a room on the second floor. Hmm, something doesn't seem right. But don't worry, you won't be in far in the second floor, so you'll just be near around here. Oh, okay. Here's the room key for the second floor. Uh, if you ever need anything, there's a phone in the rooms. Thank you. Come on, gang, let's get inside a room. Man, I don't want to go into the second floor. Me too. I'm scared we're going to see a ghost in there. Enjoy your stay. Thank you. All right, so, second floor. I guess we can take the stairs. Uh, Leorio, can you hold on to me? Yeah, of course. Guys, you really are taking Shaggy and Scoob really well. This is how we normally act. <laughs> Well, here it is. The second floor. Zoinks! I don't like the, the side of the hallway! Me too! Hmm, she did say it's not far, so the store is right here. For a room? Mm-hmm. Uh, Ryo Ryo! Ryo Ryo! What is it, Cone? Uh, uh, I can't be the only one that saw that too! What are you guys talking about? We just saw something. Me and Gone. Okay, chill it, guys. I think that's enough playing Shaggy and Scooby for one night. Let's just head into the room and just relax. Uh, okay. Come on, Gone. Okay. I can really see why no one comes to this place. They don't really take good care of it. Yeah, it's a lot of cobwebs. Ugh, I don't like the side of this room either. Yeah. Well, let's make the best for it for tonight. Ugh, finally I can take off this outfit. I don't understand. What? How come she says that the second floor is very haunted, but she still led us here? Hmm. Quite, uh, strange what she said right there. Yeah, or maybe... She may be doing this on purpose, for leading us here in the second floor, so we won't be on the first or third floor. Do you s are you saying that she could be a ghost? <laughs> well, I can't believe I'm saying this, but for the sake of boredom, I guess in their costumes, how about we all solve a mystery together? <gasps> like an actual Scooby-Doo mystery? <laughs> you can say that again. Aw, oh, come on! I want to take this off! But Kila, we do need our Velma. So come on, let's solve the mystery! Oh, where's my glasses? Did you leave them on the nightstand? Yeah. Hey, where did my glasses go? Oh, jinkies. Don't tell me I forgot my glasses. Uh, guys, I'll... Be right back. Maybe I just dropped them in the hallway. Yeah, sure, Kilua. Just be careful. I will. Ooh! Are you okay? Ugh, I can't see without my glasses. But, Kilua, you don't wear glasses. Shut up! I'm in character! Aw, oh, jinkies. Well, while Velma finds her glasses, let's find some clues. Okay! Let's split up. Really? It could not be got... Why do we have to split? That's what they did in the Scooby-Doo show. Oh, yeah. Me and Listener will look around the room to see if there's any clues, while you and Gone will be checking out in the hallway with Kilua. Why do we have to be in the hallway? To look for clues? Okay, uh, we'll be brave. You better, or else no Scooby Snacks. <gasps> I must do it for the Scooby Snacks! Oh, hell yeah, we're doing it for the Scooby Snacks. Aye, aye, Kurapika. All right, be back if you find anything. Okay. Come on, Leorio. <coughs> now they're gone. Let's look around. <laughs> okay. I know everyone's gone, so come here, Daphne. <laughs> All right, let's find something. Man, being in this hallway gives me the heebie-jeebies. You got that right. <laughs> hmm. Oh! 
What is it, Goon? Did you see anything? I just saw that door open and close. Really? Was someone opening it? There was no one. Creepy. Should we check over there? Uh, can you hold on to me if we walk over to that room? Yeah, sure, Goon. Let's do it for the Scooby Snacks. Yes, do it for the Scooby Snacks. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Housekeeping? Yeah, housekeeping. Anyone in here? Hello? I mean, this is an old building, so maybe the door is just all rusty and very hollow. Yeah, this is just an old a haunted hotel, and maybe it's not haunted. Maybe it just looks like it's haunted because it's all dark. Yeah, maybe this room won't be too bad. It just needs a little touch-up. Yeah. Hmm. Hey, look. What is it? It's Kilo's glasses. Hey, you found them! But how did it get here? Hmm. How did it all of a sudden came in this room? If we just entered in the second floor? Quite a mystery right there. Or else, these are haunted glasses! That sounds very silly, Leorio. <laughs> Zoinks! What was that? I don't know, but I think it's coming out from outside of the door. Should we check? Yeah. Hmm. Looks like there's nothing in the hallway over here. Check the other side, Leorio. All I see is a dark hallway over there. Do you think it's the coast is clear? Yeah, I believe so. Hmm. I wonder what that was. Oh! <laughs> oh my butt! Oh my head! Oh my body! Kilua, what are you doing out here? I was still looking for my glasses and I couldn't find it anywhere. Oh! Um, hold on, hold on. Here they are. Whoa, thank you. Where were they? They were in this room over here. Jinkies. That's weird. How did it end up in that room? If I just arrived? It's a mystery we have to solve ourselves. I hope Kurapika and Listener are not making out in the room because, you know, Fred and Daphne are always splitting up. Yeah. Eep! Look, Gon. It's like you've seen a ghost or something. Uh, What? Why are you stuttering? Okay, I think that's enough Scooby-Doo for you guys. Kilua, turn around. <laughs> oh, and I stand correctly. There is a ghost right behind me. Well, it looks like we haven't found any clues in that room. I guess we have no other choice but to check the hallways. Come on, let's go check. What the- <laughs> ah! oh. Listener, are you alright? Oh, your wig just snatched. <laughs> At least you're okay. Guys, why were you running? We just saw a ghost! Yeah, an actual ghost! Yeah, like, it was big and- Big eyes and- Oh god! You guys saw an actual ghost in the hallway? Yes! Well, I'm gonna see for myself. No, Kurapika! Don't! Why? What if it'll hurt you? Or possess you? Or turn you actually into a ghost? <laughs> I'm gonna go check and I'll be fine. I don't see it anywhere. Maybe it must have gone? Maybe. It can't disappear, right? It means it's still there. Uh, is that the ghost? Why, if it isn't the front desk woman. Kiki, where could she be? Hello, front desk lady. Oh, hi guys. Have you guys seen Kiki around? Kiki? Who's Kiki? Oh, she's my cat, and... Let's say I brought her to work, and, uh, I can't find her anywhere. 
Uh, hopefully the ghost did not take her. Wait, you guys actually seen a ghost? Yeah! Oh my, I guess the rumors are true. I need to tell the manager about this. And plus my cat is missing. Don't worry, maybe we will find your cat. Thank you. Yeah, what, what color is your cat? Well, she's black, she has golden eyes, and she wears a cute little pink collar. Hmm, okay. Thank you for the information, miss. Thank you, and I hope you will find Kiki and she's okay. Hopefully the ghost did not get her. We promise, miss. Thank you. Well, gang, it looks like we have a cat to find and a ghost to hunt. Ooh, double mystery. I'd say we split up again. What? what? We can't double split? <laughs> well, how about this? You guys search for the cat while me and listener find the ghost. Do we have a deal? You know what? That sounds better. At least we'll find a cute little kitty kitty. Yeah, that sounds a lot better than a ghost. All right, we have a deal. You guys search for the cat while me and listener create a ghost trap. Aye, aye. Well, hey, it's not going to be that hard. We're just going to find a little black cat and maybe it will be good. Hopefully it's not possessed or maybe it's dead, like into a ghost kitty. Or maybe. What? Never mind. Maybe it's holding the cat hostage. That would be horrible. Hey, look. What? There's footprints. And they're shaped like paws. Looks like they're glowing in the dark. Hmm. Maybe you could be right, Gone. Maybe the cat did turn into a ghost and just left footprints. Oh no. We must tell about the front desk lady. Oh man, I don't think she's going to take the news very well. I wonder what kind of trap that could up again listener would create. Me too. How will you catch a ghost? Hmm. Maybe there are ways, though. I mean, could up because the brain, so I guess he knows. Hmm. You got that right. Let's follow the trail, see where it leads to. Yeah, maybe that'll lead us to the cat. Yeah, we're gonna save you, Kiki. Oh, turn right. Hmm, it continues going right. It leads to the closet. Huh. Who's gonna open it? One, two, three, not it. Not it! Zoinks! Go ahead, Shaggy. Open it. Fine, Velma. <sighs> okay. Here we go. Huh. What did you find? It's a pink collar. Could it be Kiki's? Yeah, I mean, the front desk lady said it's pink. This could be hers. So, could it be true? Wait, look, guys. What? There's paws all over the sheets up here. And they're all the same color from the floor. Yeah. Hmm. Could this really be Kiki as a ghost kitty? Maybe. But who knows? Very good impression, Gone. Uh, that wasn't me. Then who did it? Ghost! <laughs> yes, the ghost trap has worked. <gasps> that was the ghost trap? Yes, and looks like we caught the ghost. Oh, wow. Really chained up right there, Kurapika. <laughs> of course, I have to use Judgment Chain. Well, let's see who this hotel ghost really is. <gasps> Why, it's the front desk lady's missing cat, Kiki. <gasps> Kiki, there you are. <laughs> you got me so worried. It appears this explains everything. Oh, what is it? It appears our little Kiki was haunting the hallways this entire time. Let's just say she must have ran off and accidentally got sheets all over her. And maybe she couldn't see. She starts making weird noises and runs around. 
Oh, the poor baby. I hope you're okay. And I believe she's been wandering around so much. She must have pressed some laundry detergent on her paws and create little trails. Really? I recognize the scent. Well, you guys really are acting like the real Scooby-Doo gang. <laughs> so it appears there's no ghost after all. Yeah, it's just a little kitty's just wandering around with curiosity. Well, I guess next time I should not bring my pet to work or else this would happen again. You said it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all that mystery solving is making me tired. Yeah, I don't feel scared of this place no more. Yeah, me too. Let's head to bed. I don't really want to take off this costume right now. Yeah. Good night, front desk lady. And be safe with your cat. I will. Say bye, Kiki. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Whew. Man, that was fun. Yeah, we should do this again. Maybe in the next Comic-Con or Halloween, guys. I'm really drained of being Fred. Look, can you guys shut up? I'm gonna go sleep. Sure thing, Velma. You can stop calling me that. Well, I'm gonna sleep in this onesie, because it's really cozy. <laughs> okay, Gon. Well, good night, everybody. Good night. Oh, Gon, stop it. I'm not doing anything. Quit scratching me. But, Kiloa, I'm over here. Huh? Then what's... <laughs> Kiki! <laughs>and yes, this may count as a Halloween special and very early one because I'm not going to be here for Halloween because I'm going to Mexico to celebrate Day of the Dead with my family. So like this video if you enjoyed this, comment down below your opinions, turn on the notification bell, and subscribe for some more ASMRs and creepypasta narrations. Have a wonderful day, little beans. Stay safe, stay hydrated, and happy Halloween! Goodbye for now!